How's it going everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the Let's Play. They call me the Toaster and let's get right into today's episode. So you had told me to add a little bit of texture to my walls by putting different kinds of blocks instead of just the stone bricks. Some examples that you gave were andesite, um, regular stone, and also a bit of cobblestone. So I think I'm going to try that out just to see how it looks. Uh, first, I had to put away all of this iron, so I am going to compact it down into the blocks just so that it takes up a lot less space. And I can go ahead and put that. I think I'll put the iron down here just because, yeah, all the other places are kind of full. See, I have another one here. I can't even tell how much iron I have in this chest now. So at least down here, I could always add a lot more. Okay, perfect. So let's see. Uh, I think I'm going to make a little bit of polished andesite just because I do love the look of it. Maybe not all of it, maybe half of it. And then there was also going to be stone and a little bit of cobblestone as well. All right, so let's give this a try. So I guess what I'm going to do is I'm just going to break blocks at random just to kind of give it that feeling that, you know, it wasn't really planned. Okay. And you know what? Sometimes when you're breaking, um, things can also be right next to each other. A really interesting thing about always choosing random things is that it's actually very hard for people to choose random. So if you had to guess, for example, if you were to flip a coin and you had to guess what the outcomes would be, most people often just like go back and forth between heads and tails but it's very possible to get heads like five times in a row so it's very easy to tell when it was done for real or just done by guessing so let's see i'm also going to break some blocks up here and maybe one of these blocks as well okay i think that's good that i can't should i do this one up here yeah you know what i'll do a couple up here why not okay so what do we got we got the stone we got the polished andesite we got the regular andesite um, you had also mentioned mossy cobblestone, which I don't have any vines, I don't think. Yeah, I don't have, I can't make any mossy cobble, although I think it would look a little bit nice. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cycle through them. I'm going to do one, two, three, four. Yeah. And then I guess, oh, whoops. Can I reach this? Ah, there we go. Yeah, I have really long arms. I could reach that. Three, four. Okay, next. It's one, two, three, four. And you know what? I suppose I could, yeah. Okay, oops. This one can go like that, and then we'll put another cobble. Actually, I don't want the cobble too close to the ground because I don't think it looks very good. So I'll put a polished one here. All right, and we start again. We'll do one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And the last one is the stone, just like that. Okay. Check that out. All right, I think that looks pretty cool. I think it adds a nice little bit of texture to it. Let's see, this one has a lot of the same ones repeating, so I am gonna change this out for, uh, I'm gonna break this one out and I'm gonna put stone. All right, cool. And this cobblestone, it just makes it look like it's like a temporary block. I think I'm gonna replace this with, let's see. Uh, I'll put the stone. I think it looks, I think it's like a nice addition to the other ones. I'll put a stone there too. Okay, perfect. Check that out. Alright, I think that looks really nice actually. Thanks for the tip. Alright, so let's put these blocks away for now. Put all these blocks away and let's get our, or our inventory organized a little bit. So I don't need the glass anymore. Stone bricks. Those can go in here. Let's see, diorite, the 
the string. Where's the string? That goes in the mob chest. Right over here. I don't need my axe. I'll keep the shovel just in case. I have a water bucket. And then I just have a regular bucket. So that's fine. Okay, perfect. So it is nighttime, so I am going to go catch a quick little snooze because I've been working all night and I am very tired. So let me just run all the way here and good night. And good morning. All right. So what I did wanted to do was... Oh, actually, I didn't need that bucket. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so it looks like one of them has already filled up. So I did want to make a super smelter because I have a ton of cobblestone. But first, I just needed to check <clears throat> if the shears in here... Oh, yeah, these ones are almost done. But now I finally have enough iron. I'm just going to fill this thing completely with shears so I don't have to think about it again. So it's 2 times 9, which is 18. So here... There we go. So I'm just going to completely fill this thing up. So let's go over here. Oh, whoops. It's behind the sheep one, actually. And how much wool do I have? Oh, perfect. I might need to add another chest, actually. So this one's almost done. So let's just put all this in here. Okay. And let's check on the sheep. Okay. Yeah, this farm will this farm will be working well. All right. So, okay, yes. So I wanted to build a super smelter, and I think, well, temporarily, I guess I could just build it here with this lava stuff because that kind of makes the most sense. So what I am going to need is a couple of hoppers, um, of course, some furnaces, some chests. So let's just get that project started right now. All right, so I am going to need a lot of wood over here. So let's see, I'll need, yeah, first let me just make a stack of planks. Okay, so how many chests do I need? I need two chests to put the stuff in. I need two chests to collect the stuff. And I need a chest to put all the lava in. I also need another chest for the wool farm. And I'll make one more chest just in case. I can't think of it right now. Oh yeah, then I need hoppers. I need three hoppers. So that's three chests. One, two, three. Okay. And then I need the iron over here. Because I need to make the three hoppers. Not ten, just one, two, three. Okay, and then I'll need some furnaces. Or just one furnace. For now. And then I can expand it in the future. Okay, and then of course I'll need all the cobblestone. Oh, now I finally have a garbage. I can throw this away. Check this out. Boom, shears, gone. Awesome. <laughs> that is great. Okay, yeah, so I don't need the wood anymore. And then the iron, that can go away as well. And I'm just going to bring down as much cobblestone as I possibly can. So actually, I'm going to start from the bottom over here. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. So let's get that started. All right, so the first thing I need to do is put the chest next to here for the for the wool farm. That way I'm gonna get a lot of chest, I mean a lot of wool. Perfect. All right, if you're excited to see how the super smelter is gonna turn out, you know what you gotta do? You gotta hit that like button. You gotta hit that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. All right, so I'm just gonna kind of freestyle this. So I think what I'm gonna do is, this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it's an odd number. So I'm going to put it like this, and then one of the hoppers needs to... 
Uh, no, see, actually, what I should start with is the the chest in the back. Yeah. And I put away my pickaxe. Of course I did. Or I should say my regular axe. Okay. So let's break this out over here. All right. So now I know how to start this thing. So I need to start first with the chest that's going to have the lava in it. And this is going to... This needs to be higher up. So the chest is here. It's going to have a hopper going into the furnace, which is going to have a hopper. Okay, perfect. Yeah, so it needs to go up here. And then what I need is the furnace. Yeah, just like that. So the furnace is going to go here. And then the hopper into that one. And then I'm going to break this. And then I'm going to put another chest here with that, just like that. And then I need one on top to put, okay, so I have to break this out a little bit. It is a little bit dark here, so let's light this up. And just like that. Okay, so that's the principle of a super smelter. So basically, and then I need to break the blocks above so I could actually open this chest. One, two, and I'll put some torches in there. All right, perfect. So what you do is you load this thing up. Okay. Perfect. And now, Okay, yeah, so the lava is starting to spread a little bit. Okay. So what I'm going to do is... I guess I would need a lot of buckets. So basically the whole point is that you would put... Okay, first I just got to make sure this works. So this chest gets the lava bucket. And then it goes into here, and this is going to smelt up to 100. And then it's automatically going to go into the chest below. So that's that's the whole point. And then I guess I would need a lot of buckets to do this. Okay, but just for now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to spread this all around. So what I need to do is to get a bit of glass. And I also need a couple more buckets. So I'm going to use my iron to make a lot of buckets. And I needed that glass and the stone bricks to finish out the design. Okay, and then I guess I could... Well, I'll keep some cobblestone up here just, just for now. Because it's going to take a while to smelt all that downstairs. Okay. So I need to make buckets. How many buckets can I make? 21? No, I think I only had 13. So, whoops. I only had 13, 10, and I already have, I'll just make 13. Yeah, there we go. Okay, perfect. So what I am gonna do is just yeah, spread this lava around a little bit. So I have to do this one over here. But I have to be really quick so that I don't catch myself on fire. So I'm going to take one of the lavas. And I'm going to put it... Okay, so what I got to do is I got to break. Oh, no, I broke the lava. Ah, whoops. Okay, <laughs> this one's going to be hard. You know what I'm going to do, actually? I think I'm going to go above. Because I can't really... Okay. Oops. One, two... Okay. I'm going to go again. Yeah, just like this. And then I'm going to break this one, and I'm going to put one of the lavas in here. 
just like that. I'm gonna close this up. Okay. So then I'm also gonna hide this. One, two, three. That looks good. And I have one more bucket of lava. This one should be easier to place. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna extend this by one. Then I'm going to break this and break this one. So I can put the lava here and then the glass. Perfect. All right. Oh, and it looks like we got another one. So I guess I'll just do that right now. I'm going to extend this by one. And then I'm going to break this, put down the lava, and put down the glass. All right. Perfect. Great. So I think this is a great place to end this video. If you liked it, please leave me a like. Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think. And hit that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. All right. Have an awesome day. Toaster out.